are right. Are you looking for a perfect spot to check out some wildflowers or what about a spring break adventure? Well, Hidden San Diego's Jessica Johnson is here with hey. her favorite local spots. Well, good morning. Morning. Okay, if you haven't followed her on Instagram, you have to follow her on Instagram because it's like all the things to do, all the places to eat, like things that you didn't even know. And we're locals here. So I love this. Okay, talk to me about the um, wildflowers in bloom. Where can we go find that? So just yesterday, I did a hike out at Sunset Cliffs and it is phenomenal. Yellow garden everywhere. I think of um, maybe daisies and wild sunflowers. Yeah. So you've got the ocean in the background. Mm -hmm. It's stroller friendly, which I love because I went with my baby. Oh. Um, it's very family friendly and just you can't beat those bluffs. It's just gorgeous. And so sometimes we just, we automatically think like Anza Borrego, but you're like, hey, look, you can even have the ocean in the background exactly. here at Sunset Cliffs. Yeah. I like that. After the flowers though, what, what, what is there to do there in that area? Um, so it's not super close, but I wanted to really recommend Summers Pass Farms because right now it is just overflowing with flowers. They've got a sweet pea and sunflower maze. It has a little coffee shop. It has so many picturesque backgrounds everywhere, little mini waterfalls, a wisteria um, pathway that you can walk through. And what is this called again? Summers Past Farms. Summers, are you guys making a list? Because I am. Summers <laughs> Past Farms. Okay, <laughs> this is fantastic. There we go. Um, is this what we're looking at here? Oh, that's so pretty. Again, hidden San Diego. I, yeah. I would have never known about And it's this only going to, over the next week or so, it's only going to get more and more colorful. Mm, that's beautiful. Okay, yeah. here's the deal. Adventures with the family, like you said, that was that's family friendly. But what else can we do with the fam? Um, so next Saturday at uh, the Heritage Ranch in Encinitas, they're having the Living um, America's Day or something like that it's called. But um, they also have like uh, farm animals. It's all blooming as well. And then they've got these different stations where you can learn all different skills like um, how to grind acorns, how to make butter. You get to learn about um, the indigenous history. Mm -hmm. Just really cool. And they've got a lot of historical homes there. And this is in Encinitas. This is in Encinitas. Okay. Yeah. But so that's a family thing to do. Okay, hidden hiking spot. What's your favorite? Um, I don't know if I would say it's my favorite because it's so hard to choose, but a really cool hidden hike is going through Blue Sky Ranch in uh, Poway and then hiking up to Lake Ramona. And it is filled with poppy blooming, poppies blooming right now. Right now? Yeah. Okay. And it's so funny. Every time you say anything with flowers, Hours and blooming and like make sure you take your allergy meds and like <laughs> because I just I can't believe it because of all the growth it is so gorgeous out there look at all of these flowers it's oh, not the easiest goodness. hike right. so but but the reward and then you've got a secret oh, lake the wow. only way to get to that lake is by hiking is by hiking yeah how long is that hike I think it's about six miles six um, miles but okay. um you go through yeah the shaded oak grove first and then you make the incline and once you're doing that incline is when you see the poppy show wow I mean okay okay I'm, I'm, I'm adding this to my list okay Jessica mm -hmm. okay if mm -hmm. we want to hit the road though um, we don't want to go too far is there somewhere that we can go so I was gonna recommend Alta Vista Gardens and Vista I think it's only three dollars um, and it's it's amazing. It's um, they have all different zones like the subtropical, um, the, the culinary herb garden. It's just it is phenomenal. If you've got children, if you are a lover of beauty and nature, I highly recommend going. Oh my goodness! So that is not far. You said Vista. I thought you were going to take us like hours away out of San Diego. <laughs> so that's perfect. Yeah. What? Okay. I know that we didn't really talk about this, but what is what is your most favorite thing to do in the springtime in San Diego? Oh gosh, I don't just getting out in nature and yeah. going on different hikes. Um, and I do return to the same places often because they're so beautiful. But yeah, yeah San Diego's gorgeous. It, re it really is. I yeah. mean, we, we've been talking about it all morning. Yeah, we have some rain, but honestly, when you compare it to other parts of the country, I mean, this is really why we're so blessed. We are so blessed. Gosh, yeah. that's so true. Mm -hmm. Jessica Johnson, thank you so much for yeah. being here. I'll tell you what, you can go to our website and find out more about all her recommendations. That's fox5sandiego.com. Click the scene on tab. You can also follow her on Instagram, just look up Hidden San Diego and she'll get you all hooked up. Um, it's fantastic. All right.